Ladies and gentlemen, liebe Landsleute, it was the 21st July, our first day here at the embassy, and ever since then we had a very interesting and very rewarding time here in Stockholm. Uh, it was loaded uh, with lots of uh, events, like uh, the visit of our federal president uh, Steinmeier. We had uh, now lately, within 10 days, two German foreign ministers, Heiko Maas and Mrs. Baerbock, here for the OSSE ministerial at the Stockholm Initiative. We had uh, two uh, Germans who won the Nobel Prize and we had elections in Germany as well as a new Prime Minister here in Sweden. So it was uh, uh, a loaded time, very interesting one. Uh, due to pan uh, pandemia, to, uh, due to Corona, we were not able to do as much here at the residence as we would have liked to do. Uh, we couldn't celebrate the National Day here. We hope that will be possible in 2022. Now we are looking uh, at uh, the final weeks of this year and it's for me the moment to say thank you for your help, your cooperation, to tell you as well that we will be at your service again uh, in 2022, that we hope that we can meet even more often then. And most of all, I would like to wish you now Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, lots of time for a bit of peace and recreation, for reloading the energy and to see you again next year, 2022, here or somewhere in Stockholm. Thank you.